Hey guys, Mr. Webb here. We're going to talk about um, circuit theory today. This first section of the video is going to be uh, how things work. So basically, we have uh, three different things that we're dealing with. First of all, we have voltage. We also have current. And we have resistance. Now we've talked a little bit about resistance already. Okay. Now, voltage, current, and resistance um, are the, the three terms that we're going to use. And for voltage, the symbol is going to be a capital V. For current, we're going to use amps, or capital A. So those are A-M-P-S. Okay. And for resistance, we're going to use ohms. Okay. Those are our, our three things that we're going to use. All right. Now those three things uh, basically tell us a few things about electricity. First of all, voltage is the electrical force uh, that causes current to flow. So it's force of the electricity. Okay, and that force of the electricity is what's going to cause things to be pushed. So we want to think of electricity as maybe like a hose and that hose has water going through it okay and that water is electricity so we have electricity flowing through here okay and that's flowing through the hose okay now how hard that electricity sprays out the end is the voltage all right. The resistance, if we come down a little bit lower, the resistance of the electricity is how hard is it to get through here. So if we started out with a big hose, and that big hose went down to a small hose, and we had all this electricity in here, and it all got funneled in here, this little bit right here is our resistance. Okay. Resistance is the... Um, uh, resistance or opposition of current flow. Okay, and current. If we go back up to current, we know that uh, it is basically. Let's see, what is it? It's the flow of the electrons. So it's like how many are coming out uh, of piece so it's the flow of electrons okay so an example of all this is basically if you think of you know we've got our hose down here let me uh, bring this down just a bit we'll use a little bit different uh, example okay so we've basically got a water pump and let's draw this out. Let's see. I'm going to use a different color this time. So we've got our our deal here, and it goes down to a nice big valve, and then that water comes out and let's see let's change the color so we got some water flowing through here so here's our water and it's going down hits the valve and stops now if the valve is stopping the water and causing it to come up here and fill up this side the valve is what we would refer to as our resistance okay so there's our resistor that's stopping it the force um, that's pushing down over here this is our voltage right because force um, is what's pushing okay and then the change in these that's that's our force so here's the amount of water it's pushing down that's our force or voltage the resistance is stopping it and how fast the water is flowing through this pipe right here is our amperage or amps. Okay, 
So there's our resistance, there's our voltage, and there's our amperage, and that's what we mean by it. Okay. If uh, in our next video we're going to talk about what we do to actually solve for these. Okay. So we'll see you next time.